Hello and welcome. This is Ace with John, and I'm back here on the seaside by the airport playing Frost in Fallout 4. And uh, we're going to follow up on our little um, bottle in a message bottle. Message in a bottle. And sneak out here to see what we can find. Huh. Alright, well. Something. Closer. Quite a bit. Quite a distance, actually. Of just. What? Nineteen twenty one. So apparently, whatever it is. It is nothing that we need to worry about. So let's go back to shore. Unfortunately, I'm um, turn that off because it, it's not doing anything. Um, that's a little sad. So here we are, still sneaking along the edge of uh, the known world, just on the shore. Uh, check this out. One more of these, just to see what's here. Okay, well. Hasn't proved him to be uh, as productive as one might have hoped. Huh. One of the things I was thinking was... I might go back down into the underground. Because... This is version 3. I wanted to see if there was any uh, differences between this version and uh, version 2. Uh, and I think, if I'm not mistaken, there's a metro like right over here somewhere. If not there, there's one over there and right there. So why don't we s just swim across here uh, just to say we've explored this edge over here, because, you know, there might actually be something really, really cool right here. But then again, there might not be. Ugh. There's the boardwalk. Usually there's something along the side of the boardwalk that we can uh, develop into a... Uh, way to get to the underground. Okay, they see me. Whoa! Okay, let's go for the head like this real quick. Oh, I did not see him coming out of anywhere. Okay, um, perhaps maybe a different version of death. No, 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 no. We're gonna stick with. Where were they? I have no idea where those came from. Oh, this is a cool little tunnel. I gotta go in here just because it's a cool little tunnel. That's right. There's a deer. Alright, I know where this is. This is, uh, there's a little park area right here. And right on the other side of the park area is a entrance into the metro, if I'm not mistaken. Right around here. Yeah, because this has got that little statue in the middle, I believe. Of course, it could be one of many different park areas. Ah, uh, survivors. A 
building is this? Machine gun turret. Too much fog, can't see it. Okay. There is an underground entrance around here somewhere, and we will find it, and we will go down underground. Christopher Columbus Park. Oh, I've never been here before, or I wouldn't have just found it. Uh. Well, I know that... With the marker to this location, yes. I know that there's a marker there. There's an entrance there. So, we'll keep our eyes open and move in that direction. Okay. Found by what? Okay, there's a lot of radiation right there. I do want to avoid that. None of these look like metros. That looks like some sort of bunker. That's rads. Rads, get away from the rads. What's found me? Alright, so there's somebody over there. See what kind of weapons I've got in the area of. Oh my gosh, I have no mines. Nope, just trying to get away from you people. There's another machine gun turret. Great. This whole place is surrounded with people with machine gun turrets. Oh! oh. You're dead. Nice. Maybe I should have stuck to the shore. You think? No, no. I want to find a way down to the underground. I want to check it out again just before I end the series. Ugh. There's some serious lag. Ugh. Maybe if I just run to where my destination is supposed to be, I'll do better. Ugh. Just ignore the XP thing flying up to your left. It's a bug my game has gotten on to recently. Every time I die, I have to get all my experience points for the last 37 levels back. Not one of the most awesome bugs of all time. Uh, 
Uh, nope. Oh, lots of lag. Grenades, grenades. Oh my gosh. Lots and lots of grenades. Did the other one fall to the... Yeah. I'm not going down after a dead body. 66 feet to the next metro. So what I think I'm going to do is I think I'm gonna, I am going to go down here. Fifty seven meters. Come on, get the dog. Somebody's searching. Just us, just us little bitty feety bitty but here, no one to worry about. Just me. Go away. Shooting randomly into the dark. Yay. Oof. found me. Please don't shoot me. Bandages. Nice weapon. Uh. I'm so close to where I need to be. I just didn't want to get to the metro. Come on, people. found me though. God. Okay, 30 feet, 30 meters that way. Run for it, run for it. It's right here, you can make it. Well, I have to say, it does feel good to be back inside. Underground, once again. And it looks like I've been here before. Hopefully there won't be any issues. So, I am down here, and what am I, where am I trying to go? Well, let's see what this goes. Scully Station. Wow, was it that easy to get back home? Apparently, it, it is. This is Scully Station, which has got all these glowing fungi in it. There. Turn off my light. Let's do this. Crazy. I found him. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I have to say that I do believe this game has gotten significantly more difficult in the last patch. Like the sneaking thing, I used to be able to sneak and almost nobody could see me or hear me or detect me. And you you were here just recently. I mean, 
I was sneaking close, and they heard me before I got within a hundred yards of their their area. And they one shot at me, killed me with one shot. See, look at that. Hey. Payback time. Oh. Melee weapon. All right, somebody else come around the corner with a. Come on, pin them down. Just give up. Burden to your soul that you wish to unrelease. Really? All right, so. See if I can get this up here. Loot on you playing games with me, huh? Really? Yeah, I died for <laughs> just around the bend. Found by whom? Whom has found me? And where are they? And if they have found me, why aren't they coming for me? You feel that? It's called fear. No, it's your it's your incompetence and inability to to reach me. I really just don't have time to wait for you people all day. Just die. Okay, whatever. Have fun, you delusional idiots. All right. Yep. I know where I am. Upstairs and up here is where I want to go with the yellow hallway and use the key I have to get into the main station. Yes. So back to the main station. Hey. Yes? One new thing changed around here. No, the stuff I left here is still here. <clears throat> still no interest. Downtown. Downtown. Hi, how are you? Uh, I wonder if I kick this and open this, will they kill me or not? Well, you know what? Let's find out. Sweet. Uh oh. Owner's hostile. Who's that? Okay. Handy hardware. Okay, this person's had a bad day. Marchand's final step. Huh. Parson beckons, one step closer to the end of things. But where the key? Where the keeper? Above and below, as it always was. Oh, that's, that's a little disappointing. Okay, well. Marshawn, I believe we've heard about in some other notes, as nobody's really happy with him, as he's kind of a jerk. So that must be the, like the, the overlord dude. Huh. Well, that was interesting. Yeah. So let's just close this. That's sort of a dead end, but it is an interesting dead end. Well, this is Ates' John playing Frost in Fallout 4, and I think I'm going to end the episode there with a little update on Marchand and downtown. Uh, I 
If you know of any new changes in version 3 that I should check out while I'm underground, pass that note on. Until then, I'll see you around.